Kelsey Parker, who shares two children with Tom Parker, began dating builder Sean Boggan, eight months after her husband's death. The Wanted star died aged 33 after being diagnosed with an incurable brain tumor. The news of their split comes as Kelsey, 32, marked the first anniversary of the pop star's funeral on Thursday. A source told The Sun, Kelsey has ended her relationship with Sean and is focusing on herself and the kids. The anniversary of Tom's death last month was incredibly difficult. Being alone is the best thing for Kelsey at this point in time. They went on, after Tom passed away Kelsey threw herself into work and the children. But as Tom's anniversary approached she realized how much she was struggling and decided to end it with Sean. Kelsey is being supported by her family and friends and is trying to keep her head up for the children. The source added the pair plan to remain friends. Express.co.uk has contacted Kelsey Parker's representatives for comment. Don't miss! Paul Burrell says Queen and Diana are his angels in cancer battle, latest, Meghan no longer part of royal family after coronation snub, exclusive, Paul O'Grady's pal Julian Clary gives entertaining eulogy at funeral, tributes, Kelsey and Sean began dating after they were introduced through friends and went public last November with their romance at a pal's wedding. She previously opened up about her guilt after she moved on following Tom's death. Speaking to OK! Magazine The Mom of Two, who shares Bodie and Aurelia with her late husband and opened up on feeling guilt around her new romance. Kelsey told the magazine, I feel guilt about a lot of things, but not in the way I think everyone expects me to feel. What I am going through is not something I would wish on anyone, the strength it takes just to get out of bed every single day and stay positive, be mum and dad and face my reality. Kelsey added, I'll take all the help I can get in battling through this. Anything that gives me a microsecond of relief from the agonizing grief and sense of loss. Not just losing Tom but losing everything we had built together and believed we were going to share for the rest of our lives. So no, I don't feel guilt. I question if it's right for me, my kids, my life, 